Hi, so I'm trying to go back to our channel, Mad Curls. I'm Taylor Ann. And I'm Lori Ann. And um, in this video today, <laughs> sorry, we filmed all our favorites videos all in one day. So this mm -hmm. is our last one. We are doing the Mad Curls Week of Favorites. This is the last yep. video. We are on a refresher sprays, products we use to refresh our hair. At this point, you should have seen cleansers and deep conditioners, stylers, gels, oil, like we've done. Edge controls. Edge controls. Mm -hmm. We've done it all. This is the last one, the refresher yep. sprays. And yep. um, these are the products that we use to refresh our hair when we want to refresh our curls. As we've been saying in each video that starts, that this is where it stands today as of August 2018. Mm -hmm. We've done these kinds of videos in the past, our favorites, you know, our hair growth journey, and then we'll talk about different oils and things that we liked in those videos. We've mentioned from time to time, whether it's in conversation or whether it's been a planned out video, um, a video of favorites, so to speak. But this is where it stands 2018 because when you are a product reviewer, things change. New things come on the market, things change. Um, a lot of the things we are just very consistent with and we use over and over, but things have come into our eyesight that we've grabbed and we've reached for. So as of today, August 2018, these stand as our favorites that we've been using quite frequently um, in the near past and probably moving forward. Um, you know, for a while, we're, we're satisfied with these selections that we have right now, and yeah. they've been doing the job. Refresher sprays are one of my favorite things. Mm -hmm. So, like, I know, like, my refresher sprays are super consistent. Um, so, these are the ones I feel like I'm just always going to love, especially, like, my top two. I just love refresher sprays. Yeah. I love okay. refreshing, the whole refreshing thing. Um, so, you ready to get started? I'm ready to get started. Oh, okay. I have to just see if there's some lipstick on my teeth. I feel like there is. Let me see. But there isn't. You're good. <laughs> teeth check. Teeth check. Two teeth. Okay. Okay. Um, so if you would like to see um, our favorite refresher sprays, then please keep watching. Please keep watching. All right. Okay. Okay. <laughs> would you, would you want to start? Okay. So the whole idea of refresher sprays or the idea of refreshing is kind of new to me because my hair was so short and there was nothing to refresh. It was just simpler for me to just start all over again. But as my hair has been getting longer and I've been kind of like liking the style, like for instance, this is a two day wash and go with pattern pusha, um, uh, curl junkie. I like it. I wanted to keep this energy today i like this so i refreshed today and w my new go-to with this whole idea of refreshing is this right here so oh, tentacles oh my gosh to me i don't know whether it's the technique i'm using or whether it's just a good product because i don't see where things can form curls or like eliminate frizz mm -hmm. i think you have to know the technique so i love this this is called so tentacles hair sorel nappy licious kink drink so this is the kink drink, um, yeah. I think you guys are aware of it, whoever knows about Sotanicals. And I take this and I spray it all over my hair. Now this is right here where you listen, so move it a little closer, no seriously. You don't touch your hair, once you spray it with that kind of a liquid, whether it's water, whether it's um, a refresher spray, don't touch it at that point. Yep. That's where I used to go wrong. No matter how short, no matter how long, once you put that in and then you start all this manipulating, well now you're creating frizz. Mm -hmm. And this is why people can't get second and third day hair, is yep. what's been my experience. So I spray this all over my hair and let it sit a minute, two, maybe three minutes, okay? And then after that you feel like it's somewhat dry. It still feels a little wet where you can do a little something, but it's not soaking wet and it's mm -hmm. not brand new spray. Then you just take it and you just kind of like Scrunch do it in. this. Yep. And it just kind of like forms the curls back again. That's the technique. That you have to wait though. The, the thing is patience waiting. and yep. waiting. Do not spray and start all this manipulation. You will frizz out your hair. And that's why none of us have been able to get second day, third day hair. I'm telling you, that's the trick right yeah. there. Yeah. And um, some people we know just refresh with water but that can really frizz your hair out like you need, you need some type something. of you need something like some type of a conditioner like something in your hair like water yeah. can really just like frizz your hair up um surprisingly you know as a refresher just by itself yeah um okay so i'm just gonna start with my number one i'm not gonna do the count i'm just gonna start with my number one my number one is the cream of nature coconut milk detangling mm -hmm. and conditioning leave-in conditioner so i use leave-in conditioners as my refresher sprays because um they're, they're conditioners, so it's like moisturizing, and I don't really like using spray leave-in conditioners as stylers because I just have too much hair, and I don't have time to be, you know, sectioning and spraying each section. Like, I don't like doing right. that. So I like using spray leave-in conditioners as refresher sprays, and my favorite one is the Cream of Nature Coconut Milk Leave-In. I've gone through so many of these. These are like $3 at the store, and um, this smells amazing, and you always know when I put it in, you're yeah. like, you spray in that Cream yeah. of Nature. Yeah, you really, like, go... Uh, I go in, yeah. yeah. And, um, again, same technique. Yep. 
um, as you I just kind of spray it and I might like flip my hair like this but right. I don't touch it um, until I let it settle in a little bit okay but this is just really good I love this okay all right so like you said um, just simple water you would think that's so simple just wet your hair again but it really is not that simple it will frizz your hair so what I've done is use our infamous water bottle anybody watching want to know we get this at Sally Beauty Supply um, they're there now mm -hmm. we've had a the and they're also channel. in our Amazon store. And they're also in our in Amazon store. Box. In the description box. So yeah, everybody, this is like the number one question on our channel. Where do you get your water bottles? Mm -hmm. So here's the infamous water bottle. But for refreshing purposes, I have this with the water in it. And I will add a little bit of this Weed Add Curl Quick Moisturizing Conditioner. Not the leave-in one, but the, the regular... Um, rinse out conditioner i was told this by um my stylist who, who cuts my hair to put this in with water shake it up and use this the next day to bring your hair back to life i've used this with uh weed ad styling products um in my hair to bring those back to life and i've used it with other products i just simply add this shake it up it turns of course a white milky color and um this is my styler so it's a do-it-yourself styler and you probably can do it with any other conditioner that you have at home anything that's your favorite that's personal to you I haven't tried it yet but I'm not opposed to it I can definitely probably put maybe Afrotastic in here I could put um, you know any other conditioner that I've used curl rehab whatever so I'm not opposed to doing that mm -hmm. but right now this is how I was taught to do it on this particular conditioner and this is what I've been doing it on and it, and it works it definitely works okay Okay. All right. Um, moving on. Uh, I love the Shea Moisture 100% Virgin Coconut Oil Leave-In Treatment. This again is a leave-in. This is thicker than this one. This one's a little bit more watery, although still milky. This is um, this is thicker, definitely um, milkier, whiter. Uh, I use this when my hair is like really dry, um, and I really need some type of moisture in it. And so this is uh, coconut oil, and um, it controls frizz and all that kind of stuff. So um, I love using this. Again, it smells really really good so this is another good refresher spray for your hair okay another curl refresher spray that I believe I learned the technique on aside from my stylist showing me the do-it-yourself one was when we were doing I believe the curl junkie video and I was showing this and I think I might have demonstrated either in that video or maybe after or before whatever but curl fuel stands out in my mind as the first liquidy one that I sprayed in my hair and it did not frizz it worked out I don't know whether I got distracted sprayed it in started talking got distracted went back and did it and I'm like wow it didn't frizz I don't know but curl fuel is the very first liquid one that I said I can really get into these refreshing sprays mm -hmm. not so much these creams that I've always used to refresh but sprays so again spray it in leave it yep. don't touch it two to three minutes then you can kind of carefully you know scrunch your hair mm -hmm. and bring it back to life yeah yeah all okay. right getting into i'm trying to see if this one's like milky okay so no getting into kind of like the more clear um refresher sprays that i have the first one is the jesse curl awe and spiraling spray and this is a curl refresher this smells really good i love the way this smells um uh same technique as you have sprayed in and leave it um this one I'll just you know if my hair really doesn't need a whole lot of moisture and it and the next day it kind of like hung on and I don't need um, like a conditioner that's like creamy like a spray then I'll like go in with something like this this is a little bit lighter but this is a great refresher spray the Jesse curl all in spiraling spray okay I like that um, and yeah I have one more I don't think I have anything else over here is this um, Carol's daughter almond one um, I gifted it to you then when we were doing our product stash um, I saw it again and, and wanted it back Indian giver took it back <laughs> and tried to find so many uses for it quite frankly I found a use for it during this whole favorites week videos um, I put it in my hair at, and this is what's in here now I just sprayed it let it sit and I'm like okay so now I can really dig this whole idea of spraying liquid sprays and leaving it alone anything can work mm -hmm. all right so this is what's in my hair now I like it so much because I bought it because of the almond smell but once I bought it I didn't know how to use it I kept frizzing my hair so I put it to the side and then you liked it so much and you brought it back to life in my mind so I took it back because I wanted it because it was mine and I wanted to make it work because it smelled like almond yeah so literally when we were sitting here two or three videos back filming this um, I put this in my hair and let it dry for a bit and then so you see my hair is not frizzy it's this is the last thing that's that's been in my hair aside from maybe the Jane. I don't know. I just keep putting layers and layers of stuff, but nothing's frizzing. You like nourish and shine. Um, me and my nourish and shine. But yeah, this smells wonderful and it's um, a refresher. I love it. It's okay. a leave-in actually, leave-in conditioner, but I use it as a refresher. Okay. I mean, as you said, like 
pretty much anything can work besides just like plain water. Yeah, I think water it's, for his it's hair. technique. It's simply technique. Yeah, yeah. So I love the way this smells. A lot of these things are just like the smell because if you want your hair to smell good like the next day, mm -hmm. but this one, um, if I again don't need anything that's like creamy or like a conditioner, the uh, tropical moringa sweet oil and honey endless moisture restorative spray, and this smells so tropical. It smells so good. It's actually blue, and um, I'll just like spray this in again. You know, just let it go. Um, and I find myself reaching for this often as well. Um, I can okay. really reach for any of these at any point, just refreshing my hair. Whichever one I see first, I'm like, yep, that's the one. I'll grab that, spray it in, and go. Yeah. But um, this smells so good. This smells so good. It does. But it's good. This is a good one. And the last thing I have on the table, which we actually both like because yeah. it's gone. Yeah. This was so unique. Is the Eden Body Works Hibiscus Honey Hair Tonic. They say it's a liquid vitamin, and literally when you spray it in your hair, yeah. it like transforms your hair on the spot. Like it does. Our hair is shiny yes. and it's the like, curls just pop and like where like the magic. like the, the magic happens. We yeah. say like your hair is all done, it's all styled, and then you spray that in your hair and then all of a sudden you look in the mirror again and your hair has just kind it's of like, oh. gotten better. It's almost like, you know, the Mac powder, um Oh, I'm just I'm just it's like this mac it's been sitting here for a while powder, like, they call it like beautifying powder or something oh, it smells so and good. there's this mineralized skin finish so to speak you can put on all your makeup but once you top your makeup with whatever complexion uh, powder you need and you very lightly dust this out all of a sudden you become beautiful even more beautiful so mm -hmm. to speak okay and so it's almost like that yeah where it just kind of enhances what you already have this and is so um so cool yeah this is a cool product and yeah. it smells really really good but it totally just like you said it like it it's like a finisher like transforms your hair yeah like, it's yeah amazing. It's, oh my gosh it's, <laughs> like this really was starting to look a little dry vibrant. like now it's vibrant yeah, girl. Oh my gosh! Like I, this is so cool. Yeah. I love the hair tonic because like the way we just kind of like just build these. Up. I know. <laughs> we don't You're need so pretty. Anybody, right? <laughs> 24 7 oh i like what that looks on you yeah. oh my gosh i love that lipstick love your hair right so i know i'll okay. walk by you like oh my i like that what is that you're like yeah yeah women all are, day long women are just so unique like we just love each other we do <laughs> okay okay i think that is it I think that's it for this video. I think that's it for this series. Mm -hmm. If you haven't checked out the rest of our videos, they will be out at this point. Our favorite cleansers, deep conditioners, um, stylers, leave-in, gels, gels, edge controls. Mm -hmm. We have done it all. We feel like we, we tried to cover everything. Um, check out our other videos because they are up. And these are our favorites. As, as it stands right today, 2018, August. August. All right. Yeah. Okay. okay. Want to end this video? I'll okay. wrap it up, girl. So we're wrapping it up now because now we're heading on downstairs to spend quality time with y'all. We're doing our Friday Night Live in 5, 4, 3, 2. As they always do this, right? <laughs> <laughs>